Vale gave the Ring of the Holy Knight to the Divine Dragon. Apologies, my lord. The Ring of Azure Twins lost as well. Twice my four hounds failed me. You do understand the gravity of all this? Yes. And Vale? Still in a deep slumber. No matter how much I amplify her draconic impulses, she won't awaken. She refuses her true nature. In that case, take this. Uh, what is it? An enchanted helmet. It will strengthen the spell you cast on her. My power with your spell will correct what is wrong with Vale. I see. Keep it safe. Use it when the time is right. Of course. As you will it. There is... something else I would like to discuss. What? Pardon me, Lord Sombron, but... Lady Vale is your only child, correct? My only living child? Yes. That is correct. Of course. I was speaking from fear, not fact. Forgive me. Why ask such a thing? Vale believes one of her siblings is alive. I thought it best to raise with you. She spoke of an unbroken dragonstone. Hmm. But she must be mistaken. We both know the truth. Your children were killed in the war a thousand years ago, all but Vale. I remember one who stood above the rest, with hair and eyes like fire. What was the name again? Something like... Zephyr. My lord. I do not remember all my children's names or faces. But that one I killed myself. Yes. Moments later, I was imprisoned. Did you collect the body? I... I did not. Then I rescind what I said. <laughs> the answer is no. And if you find that offspring, bring me a corpse this time. Yes, Lord Sombron. As you wish. Thanks for arranging the ship for us, Alfred. Thank my mother, not me. When I said we were headed to Illusia, she got one of the fleet's finest lined up. How was everything at the capital? Well enough. There haven't been any attacks since we left for Brodia. What a relief. I told mother what the other side's been up to. How they're after sovereign blood. She was shocked, of course. To hear about King Morian and King Hyacinth. Understandably so. As for the destruction at Flora Port, the royal family will spare no expense on aid, though it may be years before the harbor is returned to its original beauty. We must defeat the Fell Dragon so that such horrors never happen again. What's our plan? When we arrive, do we head straight for Illusia Castle? First, we should try to learn what we can from the Illusian people. Rings or no rings, if we don't know what we're up against, we could lose everything. Besides, there's something I need to find out. And what's that? Whether Vale is alright. Hmm. From our vantage, the Hounds certainly didn't seem pleased. They may attempt to erase her personality. If anyone can do it, that woman can. I know Vale killed my mother. Nothing we've learned changes that. But I can't help but worry about her. I hope she's not hurt. Yes. I suppose she's a victim in this too. And she did risk her neck to give us the ring. Or it was all an act and she's just gaining our trust to stab us in the back. Again. That's worth considering. We don't know enough to rule anything out. Still, I want to trust her. Divine One, excuse me. Two ships flying illusion colors approach from ahead. Any sign of the hounds? None. However, it appears the enemy intends to attack us. And we've got no choice but to fight them on the water. Prepare for battle, everyone!
We're fighting on two fronts. Good news is, the ship's got flame cannons that'll set fires and slow down the enemy. Be careful, though. Wouldn't want our allies to get caught in the blaze. <sighs> Since the King's death, my country has become something unrecognizable. Elusia's armies serve Elusia no longer, but the Hounds. Is this truly what I meant to do? No mistakes. Whatever you need. Understood. What's our move? I smell gold! Full of vigor. I'll do my best. Okay. As your steward. Here goes.
<laughs> They're nice and distracted. Don't mind me, chumps. I'm just here for the treasure. Afraid anymore. Protect you. Go! 
Here, Divine One. Me first! That was awesome! retainer to my uncle, King Hyacinth's older brother. When father inherited the throne, your lord left the castle, but... I remained and served for quite a long time thereafter. Princess Ivy, Elusia has not been the same since King Hyacinth's death. If you would grant me the honor, I, Linden, would be proud to fight by your side. Are you certain? If you side with me, you will be opposing Elusia. Nonsense. Where you stand, there lies Illusia. I may be getting on in years, but with my magic, I can still open these soldiers' eyes to the truth. I can keep going.
I'm ready. Rather be friends. Train more. I'll cut you down. This is what I trained for. I'll do my best. What a pain.
Serves you right. Shall we? We could have been friends. Even mighty ones fall! Victory is mine! Drop your guard. Nailed it. Not half bad. I have my orders. You will not survive this battle. For Illusia! You put up a good fight. Allow me. Allow me. I just... 
deserve no less. Thanks. Zappy! I tell you. <laughs> if I may. Yes. Impressive. Ooh. Thank you. Illusia's in sight. So... I've returned. Are you all right? Whatever has become of Illusia, I'll still do what I must. Give report is a little farther north. I suggest sailing there. Understood. It's near the castle and the cathedral, so we should be able to gather intel there. I will inform the others of our destination. Marth, Selica, Micaiah, Roy. We returned without you, but we'll get you back this time. Just hang on. Illusia. A return then to the land where we were separated from our fellow emblems. If reunited, we can at last grant the power we offer once every thousand years. We should discuss our other option. That is, the far greater power only we know about. Yes, of course, the miracle. We could use that power at long last. I would suggest Lumera. I don't like this idea. We shouldn't perform the miracle. We have to think of the future. I agree. The whole future. 
We can't favor anyone with it now. Favor someone? We're talking about Lumera. We can prevent a tragedy. Please, those of us who were scattered in other lands are still learning all that's happened. Some of us were at her castle. Some were not. It's natural to see things differently. So, we are not all in agreement. At least at present. Using our power every thousand years is one thing. The miracle. We've never used it before. Never in all of existence. The cost of doing so is not small. Perhaps we should never, ever use it. Hmm. Of course, we are not all here. What might the others think? What might they decide? Is someone there? No one? Or a, a ghost? Please don't be a ghost. Please don't be a ghost. Princess Ivy? Ah! It's okay. You're safe. I promise. Those shadows in the brush are just that. Simple shadows. I was actually jumping at shadows? You're right. Not a ghost to be seen. It isn't like you to misread foliage as an active threat. Is everything okay? <sighs> Please don't tell anyone about this. It cannot get out that the future ruler of Illusia was frightened by mere shrubbery, or even worse, that the Prince of Brodia had to come to a rescue. Believe me, I understand. I won't say a word. I am in your debt. It seems you've been dealing with this fear for a while. Here, Princess Ivy. I'd like for you to have this. What is it? Some kind of crystal? It's a gem from one of Brodia's mines. It's said to bring courage to those who need it. Keep it as a good luck charm. Then you won't have anything to be afraid of. Charity from Brodia is not going to do my royal image any favors. Don't think of it as a tether to Brodia. This is just a simple gift from me to you. Uh, <sighs> if it truly makes you uncomfortable, you don't have to keep it. I won't mind. Farewell. Thank you, Prince Diamant. I didn't know such treasures could be found in Brodia. Hey, Princess Tamara! I heard you ride wolves! Is that really true? Yep! When I was little, I tear through the halls of Sol Palace on Wolfback. Made a real mess! Impressive. I can't think of anybody that out of control in my family. Really? Most of my family is wild in one way or another. Oh, that reminds me. How do you like it if I gave you wolf riding lessons? I was so hoping you'd ask. Fantastic! I'd be happy to show you the ropes. I'm sure you won't mind getting bitten or thrown off now and again. As in more than once? Oh yeah, way more. And when the wolf's really agitated like that, I won't be able to call her off, but you can stop her on your own, as long as you've got plenty of muscle. Well... Experienced riders can keep their wolves under control, but it's a different story for newcomers. I don't mean to scare you, though. Most people do make it through training with all their limbs. I'm having second thoughts here. Maybe it's better I hold off. Can't let myself get sidelined while there's a war on, after all. Yep, yep. Sometimes the bravest thing is knowing when to call it quits. Why don't you show me camping instead? It'd be fun to learn how you face the elements out in Solm, even if it's just a little. Oh, absolutely! That does sound fun! I'll teach you everything I know! How to set up camp, which animals to watch out for, oh, oh, and most important of all, singing! Nothing beats a good camping song! Great! As soon as I get myself a tent, we'll be in business! You were up late again last night. 
If you don't sleep properly, you'll never grow tall, you know. I may be small in stature now, but I bet I'll be taller than you one day. You'll see. You see... Of course. It would be an honor to make this for you. What is a dragon's favorite food? I'm dying to know. I really hope you like it. Wonderful flavor. Beautiful presentation. Divine One, have you seen my latest drawing? Oh, I have. An old well deep in a forest, a single sunbeam illuminating a lone flower in bloom. You conveyed a perfect balance of warmth and isolation, light and dark. Just breathtaking. <sighs> exactly. You saw all that right away, didn't you? You would not believe how much time I spent hiking in the woods to find that view. But to hear your experience, to know you understand, makes it all worth it. Finding beautiful things, then sharing them with friends who would never see them otherwise? Oh, you found a lovely hobby, Rosado. I can't wait for your next piece. Aw, sweet of you to say. Hmm, but if you're expecting more, I need to raise the stakes. Hey, maybe you could help me. There's a spot I want to get to, but it's a tough hike. It would definitely help to have a buddy. I'd love to come along. Oh, great! Thanks so much!
Thanks for shopping. 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 Feel free to come again. I am Kagetsu of Illusia. I am Sigurd. Prepare yourself. <laughs> we could have been friends. Vaxing. That was fun, was it not? Sigurd, I trust you are well. It is important to me that all my friends are healthy and happy. I am quite well, but thank you for the concern. I intend to hold fast until this war is won. Will you go out with me? I am Leaf of Leonster. I will be your partner. Not yet! Have action! I need to become stronger. That was fun, was it not?
please ask if you need something, Leaf. I am always happy to help my dearest friends. Thank you, Kagetsu. No one has called me a dearest friend quite so quickly as you. I am Kagetsu of Illusia. I'm Lin. Get ready. <laughs> Victory is yours, but I won't lose next time. That was fun, was it not? Hey, Kagetsu, you can see the future, right? Can you give me a prediction? Naturally. Let me see. Hmm. Your homeland will have lovely weather tomorrow. <laughs> Take my word for it. Kagetsu, at your service. Come. Show me your skill. I'm Erika. Pleased to make your acquaintance. <laughs> I'm not finished! <laughs> Even Mikey wants fall! I feel I have let my brother down. That was fun, was it not? How do you find being on your own in a foreign land, Kagetsu? I sometimes get homesick. Sickness for home? I do not know this feeling. For me, it is all adventure and learning. Will you go out with me? I'm Ike, of the Grail Mercenaries. Precision! Power! Damn! Try again! Even Mikey wants to go! It's time for sure. That was fun, was it not? I studied you in our last battle, Ike. Your sword technique is unusual, but it has great power. Thanks. My father taught me everything I know. Kagetsu, at your service. Come, show me your skill. Lucina, Princess of Elise, has arrived. Let's see what you can do. Are you lost? That was fun, was it not? Your skill is just what I would expect of an emblem. Will you face me in mock combat? I've been admiring your swordplay as well. I'd be delighted to spar with you. I am Kagetsu of Illusia. I am Corin. I won't lose. Have at you! <sighs> this loss pains me. That was fun, was it not? Spending time with you reminds me of my birthplace, Kagetsu. You have a similar air. If it is anything like my homeland, then its air must be wonderful indeed.
Will you go out with me? No need to be shy. Even mighty ones fall! I'm not setting a very good example. That was fun, was it not? Byleth, why did you abandon mercenary life for teaching? Did you not enjoy your freedom? Of course. But I wouldn't have met my students if I'd remained a mercenary. I have no regrets. Kagetsu, at your service. Come, show me your skill. I'm Tiki, of the Divine Dragon Tribe. We could have been friends. No more. That was fun, was it not? You are always in good cheer, Tiki. Sometimes your spirits are even higher than mine. Being with you and all our friends makes me happy, Kagetsu. What do you want to do today? I am Kagetsu of Illusia. I am Edelgard, Princess of the Adrestian Empire. I lost. Disappointing. That was fun, was it not? Dimitri, from this day forward, I believe our bond will grow ever stronger. Your enthusiasm is refreshing, Kagetsu. It's nice to hear my name spoken so informally as well. I'll do my best. At least you're adorable when you're winning. This calls for a victory song! Tamara here, the Crown Princess of Soam. Sparring is a kind of experiment in itself. I'm eager to analyze what factored into my loss. This calls for a victory song! Let's have some fun, shall we? I'm Amber! The Alpaca Wrangling Master! Why? I'm crushed, but you look really cool! This calls for a victory song! Coming in. 
Hmm, your sleep seems a bit restless today. You said vulnerability isn't always bad. It felt so reassuring then, but now... I worry. Wake up, Divine One. How are you feeling? Anything wrong? You can tell me. It's just the two of us. We can talk, right? <laughs>